this thing rolling yeah, let's wing it what's going on tackle family welcome back to the channel but before we get into today's video i wanted to show you guys that i'm still wearing the same hat and still wearing the same shirt but that's beside the point i did a thing yes i did a thing uh, i was lazy and i wanted to go fishing down here in perdido again i only live about 20 minutes from perdido but i wanted to uh just stay the night here ran a condo here uh, i got it for four days it's across the way from the crab trap uh, i think it's called sundown or something like that i just kind of want to give you a little tour and uh the pricing was actually fairly good and i just wanted to kind of show you what it's all about and what i'm going to be doing so stay tuned we're going to do a little tour all right so these are uh two-story my own little personal walkway here we've already been swimming and stuff like that but uh back here is your own personal probably not gonna be able to hear me because the air conditioner unit right here but that's okay we're just gonna keep on walking and get past it there we go we're good but here look at this look at that it's your own little personal backyard this is our unit right here we're on the bottom floor you got the big fans going and stuff like that it's our happy place yes it is you get a little uh, locker here, a little rod locker. And uh, got some rods in there. Got some beach gear and stuff like that. So this is your uh, little locker that you get. Put all your stuff, your beach stuff. And uh, welcome to the humble abode. Here you got the kitchen right here. And what's in the fridge? I bet you can guess. Oh, don't mind if I do. Here's the living room and the dining room. It's living room slash dining room. But this view, like I showed you from down there, is just absolutely amazing. Got some nice beach chairs there. Just awesome. Awesome back porch. And that's the master bedroom with the sliding glass doors. Let's go. This place is about 1,300 square foot. It's a three bedroom, two bath. Um, got a bedroom here. Got a bedroom here. Bathroom here. Laundry room. And then this is the master bedroom. With the master bath. And like I said, this beautiful view that we have. And, uh... I wonder if I could just sling one from here. Just open the door and just sling a big old three ounce weight out there. I wonder if I'd make it pretty far. Go ahead and send it. Send it. So yeah, that's a little tour of it. Like I said, this is Old River. That's called Old River. And across the way here, that's the crab trap. And behind the crab trap is the Gulf of Mexico. And that's where we go surf fishing all the time. And I'm not gonna lie, the crab trap smells amazing. There we go. All right, y'all. We are on the old river here. That's the name of it. Uh, I did a little bit of night fishing last night on the docks and uh, didn't really put two and two together of uh, about video footage and nighttime and not having flashlights and all that good stuff. So scratch that video. So we're out here. I basically got my surf rods out that I use on the beach. Uh, big shout out to, uh, I'll just put them on there, Beach Power Manufacturer. Check their number out. If you want some of these sand spikes, make sure you call them up. And uh, also a big shout out to Frisky Fins Pompano Rigs. And uh, basically just using some shrimp and some fish bites. Shrimp flavored fish bites. And we're gonna see if we can get on to something. I really love these sand spikes, guys. You guys, if you're new to the surf game, you gotta check these things out. They just hold up so well. You got, got the little foot peg down there where you can just step on it, push it down in there. Just really awesome. Started fishing, started, started in up fishing freaking sprinklers came on that's always great oh I had to tighten the drag on that one oh 
Oh, why was that so loose? Jeez. All right. Set it and forget it. Let's go grab a beer. I think I'm getting a bite over here. Just did a little shimmy shake. I think so. Let me. Uh, I got a little weight, maybe. Uh, yeah, we got something. What we got? Got ourselves a whiting. A little tiny guy. Little tiny whiting. Good to eat. Really good to eat. Come on. Freaking choked it. There we go. Got a little tiny whiting here, guys. Up. Oh, all right. See you later, buddy. What a awesome release that was. All right. See you later. <laughs> All right. Let's get some more shrimp on there. and I might just leave the fish bite on there. Maybe they'll just hit that. Oh, there's something else. There's another one. It feels like another whiting. Oh, doubled up. <laughs> the old double up on whiting. Check that out. Two of them. That bottom one's not bad. The old double up on whitings. Old frisky fins getting it done. Oh, he slapped me, you little son of a gun. You little son of a gun. Look at that. Rawr, rawr. All right, buddy. Take it easy. A little bit too small. This one's not a bad size. But as much as I eat, I need to catch about 30 of them. All right, there he is. Let's see if I can get a nice release. All right, you're upside down, that's cool. <laughs> so graceful. Oh shit, I'm hooked up, boys. I don't think this one's a whiting. Oh, it's tugging. Oh shit. Oh no, I messed with the camera too much. What is it? Oh, he's got some power to him. What you got? What you got? Hey, go get mom. Babe. Come here. I don't know. Yep. Might maybe a red or a stingray. I don't know. Oh, it's a red. It's a red. No, it's a catfish. I thought it was a red. It's a sail cat. I was like, oh, it's a little slot red. Eating it on the half shell tonight. <laughs> that catfish got it right there. It's a nice little eater sized catfish. I'm not eating them today. But uh, that's a decent sized sail cat. You gotta watch for their barbs. I see. Easy there, bud. I used to go right behind the head like that. And then pinch down. Watch them flop side to side. 
that's a decent size elk hat. See, I don't know if you see this, his uh, fin right here. It's like serrated. It's like a serrated knife. Come on. Come on. I don't want to go get my pliers. I'm gonna have to get my pliers. I'm over here being stupid and lazy. Do it. There it goes. All right, guys. That's a good size gaff top sail catfish. I, I would be eating them. I would cook them up, but what do you think? Nah, we got pizza. We're good. <laughs> All right, buddy. Uh, thanks for the fight. I appreciate you. I'm going to just go ahead and toss you. See ya. There he goes. All righty. That was a good fight. On it again. Jeez, this side over here is rocking. This side's rocking. I think it's another little cat it's not, or whiting. Then again, I never know. I always say something and it's not it. Yeah, it's another whiting. Oh, no, it's not. See, every time I say it, it's a little hardhead catfish. That's another uh, species, though. We got a hard head. We've got what four whiting. Um, hard head, four whiting, and a little tiny gaff top. Or a little tiny. Big ass gaff top, I should say. Big boy. And then this little tiny hard head. See you, buddy. I'm not eating you. Shoo! God. Friggin' sprinklers, man. Getting my rod all freaking soaking wet. I'm about to just move this one. There's something on there? No way. Nah. I thought there is something on there. What? That's a big stud whiting on there. I didn't even know it. I did not even know it. This place is on fire right now, boys. Old River producing. If we were keeping fish today, this one wasn't even going off though. Like he was just sitting with it. Hey dude, hey dude. Hey bro, chill it, chill it dude. On the bottom of the mouth. Look at that. I didn't even know there was a fish on there. I just went over there because I was going to move my sand spike because of the damn sprinklers. And there's a nice size whiting on there. It's crazy. See, bud. There he goes. Excuse me. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that hook. Look how bent. That was from that gaff top. That gaff top is catfish. I probably should straighten it out. Yeah, I'll do it here in a minute. I'm gonna just throw it back out there. Probably gonna regret that. I'm gonna hook something nice and freaking gonna come off because of a bent hook. I had some guy on my last video, he said, left-handed reelers. And I was like, I just put ha 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 because I reel with my left hand, I retrieve, or I retrieve with my right hand. And um, I guess it just bugs them that I do that. And I open my bail and still cast on this side. So it's kind of like weird, I guess, to some people. But I just, I kind of grew up just doing that, you know? I actually grew up using bait casters. I'm pretty good with a bait caster. And uh, when I started using 
when I started using uh, open reels, I always just click like that, and the hands are the lines already in my hands. Then I just close close my fingers like that and launch. That's how I've always done it. And I guess that's like awkward to some people. I don't know. Maybe it is weird. Maybe I'm just a freak. I mean, I'm cool with that. If that's what it is, maybe I'm just a maybe I'm just a freak. What is this? Hardhead? I think so. No, it's a little whiting. Another little whiting. I'll tell you what, Old River, if you wanna come have a little fish fry, which I'm not keeping fish today at all. I've done, I don't know how many catching cooks I've done and I like eating fish, don't get me wrong, but I don't wanna do no, I, I, I got a condo, I rented it, I ordered pizza, not keeping them today. But I'll tell you what, this river right here, old river, if you wanna have a fish fry, there is whiting for days. And if I keep catching them gaff tops, I might just have to do a catfish fry because gaff top's delicious. If you've never had gaff top, you gotta try it. Yeah. Bloop. There we go. There we go. There we go. Remember that show, Shelby? I forgot his. I forgot the show name. It was Shelby. I never remember his name was Shelby. He said, "Here we go." Let's get the other one out there. Holy Kuma! Goodbye. Reel down. All right. I told you, come down here and reel one. <laughs> I don't want to get wet and sandy. Damn. <laughs> Say that again for the camera. All right, that's enough. You calm yourself. You calm down. This is PG-13 over here, guys. Even though I've been cussing this video, I apologize. My videos are not made for kids, though. I put it every time I make a video, just because a lot of times I do slip up and I cuss, you know what I mean? And it's just, especially when I've been drinking, you know? Oh, good, like, here we go. As soon as I said that, I don't know if he's on there or not. It was a hit. It was a hit. Just when I went up there. Ah, that's a catfish. Oh, he's off. No, he didn't. Either that or was I doubled up on whiting. He spit it, I think. Yep, he spit it. He sure did. Dang, that was a good hit, too. that last bite was it was a big bite totally broke the tip of the hook off annihilated it so good thing about frisky fins you can take that hook off and just pop a new one on boys pretty cool huh well it wasn't recording A little tiny whiting. This one, uh, this one's got the stripes on it. I don't know if you can see that. It's kind of, it's kind of cool. See, little dude. Oh my god! That's a catfish. Come on. That's a catfish. I totally dropped my water, my other rod in the water. 
Because it's starting going crazy. Oh, I was talking to you in there. Oh, it's talking. That's got to be another gaff. Yep, it's another gaff. Come on, gaffy. I'm gonna say okay. Uh, yeah. Yep, another gaff. There he is. Another gaff top. All right, buddy. I'm gonna flip you. Don't flop around like a crazy man, okay? Got it. There we go. Hey, buddy. Oh, you, I need the pliers for you, that's for sure. There it is. All right. That's number two. This one's a little bit bigger. That's probably, well, I don't know. I would guess and tell you, but I'll just get roasted in the comments. Uh, get in the picture. Get in the picture. Yeah. Hey man, put me back. All right, dude. Thank you for the fight. See you later. Woo. There he goes. Wrong way. There you go. And he's gone. That's cool. Whew, another gaff top. Them gaff tops, they fight good. Good fight to them. I'm about to go eat some Lillian's pizza, boys. You ain't had Lillian's pizza in Perdido Key, Florida. Let me tell you, you're in for a treat. In for a treat. Yep. She's wiggling over there, the Akuma. Hey. Oh man, I've been ripping them up. Gaff top, uh, sail catfish. Uh, I've caught probably about 15 whiting, 10 whiting, uh, a couple hardhead. So, that's yeah, been good, man. It's non-stop action. Some real big gaff top. Sail cat. This one's not as big. This one's smaller. I think that guy uh, don't want me throwing towards his boat. Yeah, it's just a little whiting. A little southern kingfish. I think that's the name of him. Easy there, bud. Whiting are deep in here, boys. Deep. Come on, let it go. There you go. You know what? No, I won't. no, no, no. Hold on. Just hold on. I was gonna feed you. I was gonna feed him. Oh, daddy duties. Time out. He don't have the hot air. Let me get that. Guarantee them start blowing it up. That rod's gonna bend in half. Yeah, I'm already seeing it. That's another gaff top. Oh, that's not a sail cat. Pretty sure. Come on. Come on, big boy.
cross by the line. Come on. Cross another line. <laughs> That's about number five. Yeah. Uh, catfish. Huh. I've caught a lot of whiting, a lot of whiting, and about five, five gaff tops. Uh, shrimp, salted shrimp, yeah, and fish bites. <laughs> yeah, I usually do. I ain't keeping it today, though. Y'all want it? You want it? Do you want it? Do y'all want it? No. Okay, yeah, we ordered pizza, so... <laughs> Yeah, he got it good. There it is. All right, guys. See that? It's another big gaff top sail catfish, guys. Fred, get on out of here. You know I'm catching fish, don't you? Huh? You know I'm catching, that's what I thought. Go ahead and get out of here. Try to steal my bait. He, he's trying to steal my bait. Every time I go somewhere, Fred's always following me around. <laughs> 